Have you been to London before, and are you enjoying your time in London this time? Uh, this is actually my first time in London. Um, now I am enjoying it. You know, since I've been here, you know, it's been it's been uh, great. We've, I've got a chance to you know see the see the city. Um, I, I went and drove by the Buckingham Palace um, yesterday. I did a little shopping. You know, I got a chance to eat at. Uh, some nice restaurants, so yeah, I'm enjoying it. Uh, you know, while I've been out here, and everybody just seems uh, to be really nice. You know, all the people that I meet out here, so it's really good being out here. Okay, um, you're playing this game in October in London. Um, do you ever see a permanent NFL team being based in London? Um, I, I I do. It's funny you mentioned. I was just saying that you know us, you know, coming over here and and playing games over here and promoting you know the NFL. Um, I, I think is you know it's great. Um, you know for you know, for the for the UK and and you know for all the the the, the fans you know across the country of, of the NFL and you know I, I definitely think that skies are, skies are the limit you know for the NFL and you know we can one day have a you know NFL team here I think it, it would be huge you know to to have that. Okay, then you'd, would you like to play for that team? Yeah, I would play, <laughs> I would play for any team. I don't care. I love just being in the NFL, man. But uh, yeah, I would like to play for whatever team. Um, there's a perception. Uh, in the UK, among certain people, that uh, um, American football is quite soft because you wear lots of padding. Right. What do you say about that? It's definitely not a soft sport. Um, I think I've been hit the hardest probably out of uh, 99% of the guys uh, in in uh, football um, two years ago. But you know, it's it's definitely a hard hitting sport. It's not a soft sport at all. Um, but you know, I think. Uh, you know, with us playing games over here, it gives the you know the people a chance to see just how you know tough of a sport it is. Um, the average career of, of NFL players isn't particularly long. Does that worry you? It's three to five. It's about three to five years, and that's because it's not a soft sport. <laughs> but uh, it, it, I mean, it doesn't worry me. I don't think about that. You know, I just think about uh, you know just playing a game uh, year in year out. Um, you know, just giving it my all every year, every every down, every play, every game. Um, I don't. I don't worry about you know getting hurt or you know because it's going to happen. That's part of sport. It's part of a sports period. Um, you're going to get hurt and there's going to be injuries. Um, you just got to do the best you can to uh, stay as healthy as possible. Okay. Um, do you think you're um, as an athlete fast enough and kind of skilled enough to maybe play um, kind of soccer or football? Or yeah, I think so. Yeah, uh, I definitely think I could play soccer or uh, you know rugby and some of those sports. It's uh, now, I've got a, I'm a huge soccer fan, you know, football fan, and um, you know, I see some of the best players are the quickest guys, and and the guys you know with the best footwork, and you know, not, they're not necessarily the biggest guys, or you know, um, like a David Beckham, you know, type guy, or um, Ronaldinho, you know, those types of guys. Um, you know, they're definitely quick with their feet, and and uh, you know, so I definitely think I could play. Okay, now you sick of David Beckham yet? Yeah, I know he's moved out now. Am I sick of him? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not sick of him. Uh, I mean, you know, he he's a he's an icon. I mean, the guy's you know, he's huge, universal. You know, he's he's big. And, um, you know, he's uh, you know him and you know his uh, wife together. They're you know, they're 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 a big couple, and you know they're big celebrities. So, you know, he he is what he is. You know, the guy's a great player, and he's obviously a role model for a reason. He's obviously a superstar for a reason. Well, we're sick of Madonna. Would you like to have her back? <laughs> we're sick of who? Madonna. Madonna? Oh, <laughs> why is that? Well, she moved to London and she's everywhere, you know. Yeah, I know she moved to London. You can take her back if you <laughs> so. There's been a lot in the press here, and I imagine back in the States, about the forthcoming election in America. Um, who, do you know who you'll be voting for yet? I mean, I'm a huge Obama supporter, and I think I'll probably be voting for him. Okay, brilliant. Um, one more question. Um, a uh, chap from, uh, from from New Orleans actually has written in and asked, uh, "What's your favorite New Orleans food?" Um, my favorite New Orleans food uh, would probably be shrimp. They're big on seafood down there. Seafood is really big in New Orleans, so I would probably say um, you know, shrimp. Any shrimp dish out there, you know, it's pretty. It's really good. I'm a huge shrimp fan.